Hello YouTuber, this is me Ryan, Sailor Hemi here. Um, I've made the decision to get rid of all my remaining Mega Drive games as I've got 17 mint remaining Mega Drive games left. Basically 5 Japanese, a few Genesis and a few PALs and all that. Apparently they are on www.trademe.com co.nz so www.trademe.co.nz they're on auction at set prices and all that in New Zealand dollars and I'll give you the link down below so I'm just apparently trying to move them along or they might take a while to sell because the prices are quite fair to something that I'm happy to try and get for them some might not sell for quite some time so they've all been on auction today and I'll tell you what they are. They're all mint condition. Everything's mint on them. Some look like they like they like they knew and all that because I've looked after them for those many years. Because you probably remember me when I used to do YouTube videos three years ago of my Japanese collection. I got to about 413 Mega Drive games, and I was that big 90 kg short fellow Ryan. And now I'm just 58 kg Ryan, but getting moving them on so. The PAL version of Super Street Fighter 2 mint condition complete. Good click to the item. Um, what else we've got? Batman mint condition complete. Click to the item. Been well looked after. This is we may as well count this. This came out last year. We may as well say brand new. I've only played it twice. Twice. I've completed it twice. It's Monster World 4, the English version, booklet, everything's complete, brand new, the back of it, it's on Train Me as well. So, Super Street Fighter 2 is 55 New Zealand on Train Me, Batman is 45 New Zealand on Train Me, and this is 112 New Zealand on Train Me. Golden Axe 3 is the best Mega Drive game, complete in mint condition, it's on train me for 45 New Zealand dollars right now. So what, what I mean is it's open to overseas bidders and all that, if somebody wants to buy the game I can freeze the auction or I can put the price, I can store the auction so we can um, sell from New Zealand or even overseas because I've PayPal accounts. Golden Axe 2, complete mint condition. Another good collectible item. Golden X1 complete. Mint condition as well. Good collectible item. Bare Knuckle 2 mint condition complete. Good item as well. Oops, sorry. Um, Golden X. 2 is 45 New Zealand, Golden X 1 is, no sorry, Golden X 2 is 35 New Zealand dollars, Golden X 1 is 35 New Zealand dollars, Bare Knuckle 2 is um, 45 New Zealand dollars, Bare Knuckle 1 45 New Zealand dollars, mid condition, complete, another good collectible item, I would say all of them are good collectible item, the Asian version of Green Dog, so got a little card, um, how much is it? I think it's 35 New Zealand dollars. Good item. Uh, Turtles, platform turtle um, hyperstone, mint condition, Genesis. $55 in trade me. Good item as well. Good old Jewel Master, mint ass, like nearly new. $35 on trade me. Complete. Yep, everything's complete. Rocket Knights Adventure mid condition, good collectible item. They've all got UK booklets, no Australian leads, all from the UK for the PAL Mega Drive games only. Uh, mint condition, complete. Good item as well. Um, World of Illusion, complete mid condition. It's missing the tag, but it's 100% mid, uh, mid condition, complete. And good item as well. So, Jewel Masters, 30. New Zealand, Word of Illusions 45 New Zealand, um, Quack Shop Mint Condition Complete, 
forty-five New Zealand dollars. So, um, cast of illusion, complete mint condition, forty-five New Zealand dollars. Good item as well. Uh, these two are not on trade me. Um, yeah, yeah. Cast of illusion, crash shop for forty-five. Uh, Mickey Circus Mixing, say make it thirty-five dollars. It's mint condition, say like 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 new. I just got it not long ago. Complete, good quick flow item. And Aladdin, I have to buy it twice, but that's a mint condition one there. Say um, I'll make it cheaper, twenty twenty five New Zealand dollars. Complete mint condition. So these are your seventeen games. I had 26 but I sold them and got some on hold for another fella so these are the last 17 games left and I'll be quite happy if they go to a good home or a good collector. I've well looked out for all my Mega Drive games over the years and all that and thank you for everybody watching all my YouTube videos so now what I've done is I've crossed over there won't be any more Mega Drive um, YouTube videos, but there's going to be YouTube videos of my bodybuilding and how I lost all that weight. I've, over the years, I've lost 30 kgs and do the gym and keep fit and all that. More videos to come up next week of that as well, but there's probably 10 or 12 bodybuilding videos there as well. And there's all, all my YouTube um, Mega Drive videos going back to three years ago that I'll leave on there for people to have good memories of when I was collecting Mega Drive games and just about complete Mega Drive collection but they are going up in value Mega Drive games now but things are changing my wife from Indonesia Shelley's coming soon in New Zealand in August so I've got to save a bit more money and look for some work so hope everybody enjoys this video I'm going to be sad to miss the Mega Drive games but I can always download them and play them on my little joystick on my laptop so I've got a laptop now a built in camera before I used to have a camera like this but it's a life port machine it's just a bit junky and doesn't really work it only works when I push it hard like that and use it it's my old YouTube video camera but don't use that anymore and I'm just quite glad for everything and um, I'll keep you posted and Anybody's welcome to buy the games from America, Germany, just if you see them on my train me auction on that link, just um, I'll give you my email address so you can contact me and we can work something out. So everybody, you have an awesome day over and out. Cool, cowabunga.